No, nah, just, well, about the recording, about, tell us about, um, from the moment, I don't know, we approached yeah, you and how this all developed and how it worked out and some technical thing. Tell us, like, wrap up. No, well, why not, why not present a question and I will try to answer that because it's, like, hard because there's it so many different levels of our friendship and our relationship. You know, how we met was you looking me up on the internet and then that that took a, a bit of time and then we had uh, mutual people we knew yeah. then we hung out together and then you come you come to a couple of shows so Where's there's the, a lot of you know before of... before it got to <laughs> <One second. laughs> right. so before you know before it got to you know it being like hey, can you come and help produce and mix this project? It was all this other stuff. We did a couple of gigs. Yeah, exactly. So Georgie, right? Right. Yeah, exactly. That's right. That's right. So actually, Sir George is is how I hired you, where we bonded, where I was doing this Brazilian artist, uh, Sir George, at uh, the Blue Note. We were doing live at the Blue Note. And and I met my new Brazilian friend, and I said, "Wow, what a perfect thing!" You went to the gig, remember? I played at Bari, mm -hmm. and yeah, that was how. Yeah, right. But then I said, "My new, what, yeah. what a perfect thing for my new Brazilian friend exactly. to come down and be the mediator, yeah, uh, kind of like act as like the stage manager yeah. for this gig while we were doing the gig, and yeah. that was a, a job that we didn't bring in the truck." We set up upstairs in the dressing room, yeah. and then we had the Mike Prees ne near the stage with the splitter, and he was our guy there doing and, and the do. Remember, I got dinner. I got Anna in. I was like making a mess. Oh, you, were, <laughs> you were like, you know, you were the guy. Oh man, it's like <laughs> I need more interviews. <laughs> Everybody knows already that you're like <laughs> this is live streaming. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then... <laughs> what, what, what? What? <laughs> 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 But actually, our friendship started from really just you wanting to make acquaintances and meet people. And then, you know, I, I, I figured out a way of connecting us with the Sir George gig. And then what? And then it builds from there. You've come and helped at the shop a couple of times when we yeah. needed some help. Yeah. And then, um, then I invite you down to the uh, uh, the um, Terminal Five gig. Yeah, yeah. And how do you pronounce that band? Capital Inicial. So Capital Inicial, right? Yeah, all right. That's pretty good. So Capital Inicial. Yeah. Which means what exactly? The capital incident, the initial capital for a, a but for like the initial budget to create a business. Really? Yeah. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Yeah, capital as in yeah. like money. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, interesting. I didn't know that. I, capital incident. I think that's what it is. So we did that video at uh, at uh, Terminal Five, and you came down and hung out there, yeah. and I met your friend. Yeah, Ed. Yeah. Right. Right. That's right. Cool. And I think Ed was working here, right? He, he, he knew Roy. That was the guy you were talking about, right? Yeah. yeah. So, you know, the bottom line was, while all this was happening, you know, Victor was talking about, you know, uh, me helping him out with the uh, material. And, and so, been back and forth sending me material. I said, pick some songs. I think he sent me like eight or ten yeah, yeah, tunes. Yeah. Yeah. And I think I actually picked two or three. Of of the uh, yeah, of, of these you got two of the the ones where we yeah I picked two of yeah. the of the three I felt that uh, those were the strongest at the time but to be honest with you now completely different approach you know I think all four of these songs have so much strength and I love the arrangements I love like what we did with the overdub on the guitars and stuff yeah. and so, you got so more very stuff happy to do with that in December we got still more stuff you stepping on my lines bro. No, no, we just <laughs> we're talking, man. <laughs> Is that what we're doing? I know. That's <laughs> shit. I mean, I know I'm that. trying to make it like come a little bit more. Come on, Lino, Lino. Come on. So come what, on. Maybe Don't you do that. The, you need no, a hey, watch I your need head. a smoke. I need a smoke. Hey, hey come on. Watch your head. Hey. <laughs> you know what I mean? Get some Red Bull. <laughs> yeah. Man, the there's still some on the floor, yeah. man. <laughs>
No, but uh, all in all, I think, uh, you know, that was all. And then we were talking about where, where we were going to capture it and the whole idea of having that connection with Roy mm -hmm. and John and, you know, you come in here and, 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 uh, and this studio taking a liking of uh, the fact that you did work with Roy was, I think, the big key of why oh, we yeah. really wanted to do it here. Yeah. You know, it seemed like, you know, the only logical thing. And, you know, and it's, it, I've got to tell you, it's really hard not to not to support this place with the fact that no matter how awesome, you know, Billy is putting together this console. I mean, when you think of the history of what, what has happened here, you know, what I think what the original console here was, this portion of this, the original with the focus right portion is about, what, five or six years now, right? Mm -hmm. And then Sandy came in, Super Son, uh, Super Son, Super, Storm, so, <laughs> Super Storm Sandy came in and kind of really destroyed many businesses, and and uh, really put a dampener on things. And the the amazing thing is to see this place reach to this level as quick as it is. I mean, there's there's some companies that t to this day have not survived that, still waiting to you know get lifted and uh, you know lifted from the ashes so to speak mm -hmm. so you know it, you know how how can you not support a place like this and the room is awesome you know it sounds great and you know the attention to the session is important so you know it's great kind of you know being in an environment like this so <laughs>